Uh, the Don Modernia is holding is actually Johan. So many yeah, Shikikans can't handle the fact that they've been cooked by Johan. <laughs> this is someone who likes NTR. Nike Hot Takes. All right, we're going to be going over a thread made three days ago with 700 comments. We'll check only some of them. Uh, and we will sort by controversial because those are the true hot takes. All right, those are the true hot takes, not the ones that are popular. So, first of all, starting with the guy who made this post, his hot take is, I don't find the Doro memes funny. I'm not into poly relationships, so I'm not a fan of both Blank and Nor. Share me if I were to pick one of them. There, I said it. All right. Fairly tame, fairly tame takes, I will say. Let's go into the important ones, right? Again, we're not sorting by best. We're going by controversial. We're going into the PVT. All right. Let's see. First. As a woman, it does kind of bother me, the hypersexualization of some of the characters, especially these cool girls. Ooh. <laughs> I think that's wrong. And some bodily proportions are incorrect. I get it. It's supposed to be a lewd anime game. It just gets under my skin, especially like Tia and Nor. They're bigger girls, yet their arms and legs are too... Th okay, see, we, we, start, we start better now with the real hot take. <laughs> so, um... I will say if 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 that gets under your skin, maybe you can like stop playing a couple days because maybe the game is not for you and it's completely fine. Remember that gachas are not for everyone. Uh, they will keep adding characters like that, right? Like it or not, you can like it, you can dislike it. If you dislike it, you can leave the game. If you like it, you can keep playing the game. To me, it doesn't matter. It's much naga, it's much dia. So let's keep going in here. All right, it's a game. It's fictional characters. That's it. Uh, Dovam, the guy that wants to wipe out the outer rim, has a point. All right, all right. <laughs> An interesting one. I saw a couple posts like this. I, uh, I I don't think I could agree, but you know, the first Dovam lover in Nike. Interesting one. I said it before, you all only hate Crow because she ruins the immersion of the waifu harem and it makes you mad so you come up with other reasons to justify your unreasonable anger towards a video game character. No, she sucks. The problem with Crow is that she is a bad billion. She has no personality. We don't have even the reasons as to why she just wants destruction and everything is bad. Everything has to explode. She has no motives. There is absolutely no uh, background, no development, nothing. It's a boring character that doesn't work as a billion. It, it's literally boring. Her reasons are retarded. Oh, I just like things to explode. What can I say? I'm a bad girl. Again, her, her design is good. Oh, and God. maybe at some point we get an event where we uh, where Shift Up goes into the backstory of Crow and what and why she's like that. Jury Ships in Nika are really good. Uh, Jury Ships, I, I'm assuming he he's talking about just two girls, people shipping them together. Uh, don't care. I don't see how that could be like a, a hot take itself. But it is what it is. Oh, okay, okay. Modernia is us, and I don't get why people like her. I agree. I agree with you. <laughs> Barbican should get Papillon. Okay, this is against the Raymond propaganda. All right? The same. Viper is as guilty as Crow with the shit they pull together. With this, I agree. But at least we've seen some development with Viper. Uh, I could say Viper at least works as a villain. I think she is one of the most shittiest characters, personality-wise. She has a shit personality. Like, it's awful. Like, if this was a person, I wouldn't get close to it, right? But it works as a villain. Crow is like, there is no motive at all. Um, again, I could agree that both are uh, as guilty. Same for Jackal. Even if she was being used, hey, this is what it is, right? It is what it is. But yeah, a lot of people will defend Viper because, well, she's hotter and gaslights you. <laughs> there should be a female commander. Well, well... Uh... Hot take, I don't think people would care too much, uh, even though they most likely prefer the self-insert commander. Right? Oh, okay, Citrix Destroyer. Nike should quit making lonely characters permanent. <laughs> I don't even think we get that many. How many lolly characters do we get? Like, in general, we don't get that many. There is a few, but most of them, I would say, is mostly mummies. Most of the time, right? Most of the time. Remove Ray from the game? Agree. Agree. <laughs> I'm convinced some of the characters are in a relationship like Tia X Naga and Pina X Dorothy. They were so obviously in love. I don't think that's like a hot take. I don't think that it would even matter. 
uh, since they can just write whatever reasons they want in their story. So they also love you because every single Nick in the world loves the commander for some reason. <laughs> but I don't think it would matter or it's a hot take. I've said this before. All bond stories are their own timelines whose canon status are debatable. This is similar to how death in sim games work where you choose roots. Another, just because I play Nikki doesn't mean I'm perpetually horny. Uh, me make enjoying my wife whose clothes doesn't mean I favor censorship. I will not enjoy seeing my best girl Diesel in micro bikinis acting uncharacteristically sluty. Ooh, okay, okay. First one was like a, a safe take. Second one, not so safe. <laughs> Let's be honest, if we get a diesel on a micro bikini, most of us would get that skin. All right, let's be real for a second. Even though she's one of the sweetest, sweetest girls in the game, we would buy that skin. And the reason I skipped the dress was because it was too safe for me. Because it fits her personality. There's a cute dress with her strawberry, she's shy, fits perfectly. But I don't want that, all right? Give me those chicks, all right? I mean, say, <laughs> just say. Exactly, this is Nikki. I want a good. <laughs> Let me see. I came to this thread late, but I have possibly the biggest and most hate controversial Nikki opinion. Makima is far better as a design with her over a code, and the people who complain about it are just a bit plain in their taste. I'm not gonna be getting into all of this paragraph for the code, but I'm gonna say it doesn't matter if she has the code or not, her design is trash in Nikki. Her eyes are good, yes. The best part about Makima. Uh, the rest of the design. When we talk about fan service in Nikke, it's not a good design. It doesn't matter if it's cold or not cold. Like, it doesn't matter. It's boring. But again, collabs are not here to get the most fan service. Collabs are here to bring new players, sadly. Sadly. Um, Anne is a boring character and just emotional manipulation bait a story. Ooh, I couldn't care less about her. Now, I just keep every single story. You all know this. So let me know, guys. It's an a boring character and just emotional, or is this an L take? What is this? L take, L take. <laughs> she has personality, though. I will say. I couldn't care less about most SR Nicks other than the. Visually countess. speaking, a controversial take. Miracle Fady oh, N wow. is one of the most uh, best-looking characters in the game, bro. I don't know why we don't get more characters with extra effects in their idols, uh, like she has with her wings and with the Fady. Uh, pretty cool, pretty cool. But it is what it is. Uh, again. You guys say it's an L-take, so we'll go with L-take. Nihilister shouldn't have survived our encounter. She's way overrated and Dragon Bombing stuff is beyond annoying at this point. Crow is evil, but she's not the evil one. Not when Ether and Nihilister are around still. Even Ether, I will say, has a better personality and ambillion arc than Crow. And Crow has done a lot of wars in, in the whole 32 chapters we have. Right Now, I don't agree with uh, Nihilister itself. Eh. I think it's a little bit weird how many times you have to fight the same characters, but it is what it is. They will drag around the story a, a, a little bit, right? It's fine. I want to see more character designs like A, sir. That is the biggest L take, the most retarded take I've seen in a year and a half. The fuck you mean you want to see more like this? What is this, Victorian maid? This is literally one of the worst, if not the worst, design. I need Nihilister to sit on my face, RN. You say. All right. Just saying. Dress them more along their actual work lines. This is supposed to be a war game, not a softcore porn screening. No, it's not a war game. It's a fan service game you can play with one hand. That's what they advertise it. RPG you can play with one hand. It's not a war game, all right? There is a story? Yes, but let's be real. The main focus point of the game is not that. People will tell you that it is. It's not, okay? There's a reason why specific characters sell more than others, like it or not. Um, let me see. If a character finds itself uh, dying, it should remain dead. Honestly, the whole I lived bitch scene is uh, uh, is getting super old and repetitive. I can agree with this one. I can agree with this one. All right. I kind of agree with uh, down this take here, though. It's retarded. <laughs> this is a fan service game, like it or not. She needs a summer alt. The story is just PGR with bigger books. I've actually seen people compare the Nick story to Girls from Online rather than PGR. I haven't played PGR. I haven't played Girls from Online, so no fucking idea. Let me see. This guy has multiple, multiple hot takes. A, some of you are a bit much like uh, some of you are a bit much like taking this fan service to her. It's a fan service game. I don't really like the story, but the story has its issues, like not keeping characters dead. So I said this. I kind of agree with this though, but then it doesn't make sense from the shift up perspective to want to sell these characters later. Right? This is what it is. Some of the censorship designs 
censorship designed? Huh? He, he, he means censorship, right? He means, like, for example, the, the anis that they use on the promotion pictures rather than this one. Uh, no, keep the fan service. If you think Nikkei should have less fan service, just leave, please. I don't, I, I don't, I don't need you in this community. I want more fan service, not less. This is what it is, right? I'm here for a reason. If I wanted to play something that's not fan service, there is plenty of gachas out there. Actually, no, there is no gacha that will not get fan service. <laughs> the industry knows what people want, all right? And the reality is that people that spend money are the ones that want the fan service, not the people who are complaining about it that will most likely not be Wells. It is what it is. Speak with your wallet, basically. You want them to add to the signs when a banner with eight comes out, get her core seven. If not, shut the fuck up. Pretty simple stuff. The media system is us. There should be a proper pitting instead of the annoying ass tickets. Um, don't agree. I think the tickets is one of the best things in Nike. I think it would be nice. We will never get it. It would be nice if we could also get a guaranteed every X summons, right? Every hundred summons random as are. Again, they will never do it, but I like the tickets. You can save tickets. I can get shafted on four banners. And I can still get those four characters because I have the tickets. Something a lot of games will not let you do. In fact, most of them will not even get you to. So again, this is me. Uh, some designs and voices don't make sense to me. Like, for example, I think Red Hood and Jan should switch voices or later should actually look like an old woman than some child. Um, in JP, most of the voices, I think they fit. In English, I've seen people complain about Jan because she has a, uh, a southern accent. Which makes no sense. And then lastly, I know MC is a self-insert, but goddamn, he is easy boring as fuck. <laughs> I wouldn't say boring as fuck. I will say in game depends on their personal lighting. Yeah, I will say sometimes the MC is just retarded. I will say boring sometimes is retarded, but I don't think that's a hot take. Uh the sensor person of Sunsu to Rosanna was better than the in-game in every way. These people, these people are tripping really, really hard. Really, really hard. Again, you don't like fan service? There is plenty of gadgets out there you can play. <laughs> if you think I I mean, the moment Nika stops fan service, I'm out. Pretty simple. Right? Pretty simple. The moment we don't get things like this or play, babe, look really good. Why would I play the game? To get characters like A constantly? Nah, fuck off. Uh, the doll Modernia is holding is actually Johan. So many S yeah, Shikikans can't handle the fact that they've been cooked by Johan. <laughs> This is someone who likes NTR. <laughs> I cannot agree. I'm sorry. Uh, I think it would be funny, but it wouldn't make too much sense. Right? It wouldn't mean too much sense. Is Johan the new Raymond? <laughs> Ooh, okay. Nikki should not have to show off any skin to be likable. They and we should have enough respect to like them when they're fully close, not when they're showing off their boobs or us. This, this is uh, bait. This is bait comment. 100%. 100%. There is absolutely no way someone playing Nikki thinks this, okay? This is a bait comment. Pretty simple to me. Throw is nice, good, and wholesome girl. This is even more bait, but I would I would buy this skin if it was to come out. In a heartbeat, I would get this, okay? I'm just saying, I'm being honest, and a lot of you would get it too, all right? <laughs> Sensor designs often look better than the actual designs. Uh, no, they don't. They don't. There is literally no design that looks better. Here. <laughs> they tripping. Someone is tripping by saying that this is better. For the neon fans, I want neon heads on a spike. For everyone else, no. Coats and shirts aren't your enemy. You're just uncultured and lack taste. Oh, okay, okay. <laughs> With this second, I could, I could, depending on the character, agree, depending on the character, how they look. Because sometimes people... For example, with Sameranis, right? People complain about her, her coat, her coat, her, her jacket. I don't think it's that bad. You can appreciate the ass. You can appreciate those legs, right? The jiggle. I like it. Um, neon heads on a spike. Maybe it's going too far. <laughs> the commander clearly doesn't believe in monogamy. So therefore, neither would the Nikes. The horny ones, they are fucking one way or another. <laughs> Why is there so many people who like NTR? What is wrong with you fuckers? What is wrong with you? I don't get all the love for Rappi. I prefer Anis and Neon over her. I prefer Anis over her, but I do understand the love for uh, for for Rappi. It's pretty obvious, all right? She's been probably one of the most loyal and faithful girls since the beginning, right? I prefer Anis, but I can't see why people love her. 
I skip pretty much every event story that isn't about pilgrims and Scarlet, except like collapse, that's a different thing. Other manufacturers, nothing. <laughs> this is my alt account. <laughs> well, I mean, I didn't even read Didi Scarlet story, so... <laughs> I don't think that that's a hot take, but it is really. Sakura and Rosanna have zero personality outside of being waifu bait. Sakura especially was unbearable during the summer event. Ooh. I will say Sakura was the best one during the summer event, 100%. But to each their own. Oh, this is a uh, hidden way. Oh, when is 15? Mel Nick introduction would be good if the implementation of the idea follows the step that fate grant ordered. Are we getting Mel Nickest? <laughs> they, they, they already said we're, we're not getting them, all right? They already said we're not getting them. I personally couldn't give a fuck if they did introduce them, but there's a reason why in the lore the game is called Goods of Victory, and clearly people play because they want to collect girls, wives, that's it. Um, events and advising, romance are not canon. They are because Rosanna told me so, right? I went to that room with her. No one is taking that away from me. Uh, the story is mid, and that's okay. I will say the story is always going to go, like, it's going to be up to your taste. For you might be mid, for someone else might be trash, for someone else might be amazing. Of course, Sephiroth and, and, and all three are right, literally, because it's subjective, it's to each, to each their own. Uh, you cry too much about censorship in Nikki ads, that is true, that is true, that's, that's not the hot take. People complain too much about the ads, even Azure Lane a lot of times have to change their ads because Twitter, uh, Instagram, Facebook, etc. Like it or not, in-game, it's gonna be different, but people he jumped the gun way too fucking fast. Minus eight, a crow lover. He even has a, a crow profile picture. All right, all right, all right, let's see. Crow wants a better life for all Nikes, but because of her actions before becoming a Nike and the laws put in place, terrorism is her only option for any change. That is, until the commanders show up. And despite everything she did, they still try to do better for all Nikes, herself included, so she might try to help them in the future. <laughs> As someone who's actually in the lowest bottom of the barrel, that is the arc, and doesn't hold back on anything she thinks and knows. Crow actions are fucking retarded. There is no excuse. I want a better life for Nikes. Let me blow the fucking arc so everyone dies. Manipulate Juni and kill Diesel, her brother, and everyone in the train. Amazing character backstory. <laughs> her design is good, all right? Her design is good, but she sucks. She has no personality whatsoever. I can't stand Elec because of her personality. I don't like her Japanese VA. Her stupid hairstyle? Is this a reversible wig or what? Why does it have a brighter color inside? And what? Um, and that she spends all day with boom this or boom that. Two, two or three times it might be funny, but it ends up tiring me out. L take. L take invalidated because look at that belly. Exactly. Invalidated. <laughs> INVALIDATED! God bless Alec. A lot of the recent girls are just sex, romance, appeal, and lack much actual personality outside of that, especially Samuel Rosanna and Sakura. Um, I don't think this is a hot take, and of course it will happen a lot. You have to remember that Nika releases three characters per month. Two, three, depends on the month. She's so Two, cute. three characters per month. Most of them are gonna be boring, because there is absolutely no way where they make, again, a hundred fucking characters, you know, every year or whatever, uh, where, where they make them work where they make actually every single character interesting. And that's a problem with how many, how often we get characters. Shift up will not change that because they found a good formula for selling banners, selling tickets, selling absolutely everything. So there is no reason why they would change it. I would also prefer if we get less characters released and they are more interesting, keep the fan service. <laughs> Uh, the obsession and pause about people getting constantly horny over costumes or person animations is kinda old. I get the game is basically hentai bait, but some of the posts in the subreddit just get embarrassing. Um, the Nick Mobile subreddit, you have to understand that it's controlled by ShiftUp, that there is an employee of ShiftUp as a moderator, and they don't allow any discussions about the game or the systems. They Most of, most of the time, they will remove this post. You only see fan art, you only see cosplays. And you only see some mega threads from time to time, that's it. Literally, that's the official uh, read. It's trash. Completely justified, even if by accident. I actually think that both Crow and Viper should have died in. <laughs> Again, we, we all like Viper more because she has shown that she wants to change. She should have died there. But I think... Official Nick CC. <laughs> everyone here should have died. I think Siyuan was right here. And I don't like Siyuan. <laughs> 
<laughs> but this would have prevented a lot of things, a lot of things. But as usual, the commander is like, no, I can save everyone. Marian death is not emotional and sad. You met her for 10 minutes and then she dies. All she did is simply say that the commander is kind to her and that's it. And Shiftab tries to force you to cry so hard that the only thing is missed uh, was a guy with the big ass neon sign saying, see, this is sad, cry now. I don't think it's intended to make you cry. I think it's intended as an introduction to the game. She is the, the tutorial character. She dies on a cinematic, pretty good cinematic. And not only that, but it also holds as an introduction as to how the commander is going to be a pussy for 32 chapters because he doesn't even press, <laughs> because he has problems, you know, pressing uh, the, the, the trigger. And also an introduction to the whole modernia story, which is a big as part of it, even right now. Even right now, it's, it's still a big part of the story. So I don't think it's, it's meant to be just emotional and sad. It's meant as an introduction to what's about to come for literally 32 chapters. Why over meta is doomed? No, it's not. That's retarded. Uh, will you progress better with meta? Let me let me do this for what they will come out. Would you progress better with meta over waifu? Of course. The majority of people don't do raids. The majority of people don't do PvP. The majority of people only collect the characters and read the story. People think that everyone plays like them until the moment you really meet casuals. The casuals are just reading the story, pulling for the new character, leaving the game. That's it. They don't do anything. That's it though. Enough politics. Enough politics. Let's do, do dailies and push some hard campaign. All right, bosses, it is time to push some hard campaign. Yeah, <laughs> 